or I can just go for it myself. So, one of the things we have available to us right now is the Imperial Library. Oh, might this be your first time here? This is the Imperial Library, which was built by the Akra Summoners Hall. One could say that all the data summoners have gathered from all over the world is being collected within these chambers. Summoners are always welcome here. After all, you are the ones that provide us with all sorts of information regarding Grand Gaia. By the way, would you like a cup of tea? Oh, are you sure you wouldn't like some? Actually, I would love some right now, to be honest. But that's rather strange. All the books I've read about human etiquette mention that offering tea is always customary at the beginning of any interaction. I wonder if that really applies to all humans. Me? Oh, but how awfully rude of me! I have yet to introduce myself. I am Rince, right? Rince. I'm gonna go with Rince. Of House and Intelligence. Rulers of all knowledge. I am in charge of this library. <laughs> it seems that this is your first time hearing about the Intelligence Clan. Their exterior may resemble that of a dragon, which uh, he's actually kind of adorable, honestly. That's, like, he's pretty adorable. They're quite pacifist in nature. Again, you don't look like a pacifist, you look like a scholar. However, other than that, there is nothing special to, to be said about us. However, if we're referring to differences other than our appearances, I guess you could say that we have the ability to access the memories of any intelligent creature. Oh, so you wouldn't be able to, You would not be able to access the memories of some people I know! Well, most members of the House and Pelts usually never come in direct contact with, contact with humans. The reason being that they would hate to witness the foul things that may reside in, within a human's mind. You're not wrong, my good sir! But frankly, I personally find that felt to be quite interesting from time to time. Oh my. I don't think there are any other members of the Intel clan to associate themselves with humans besides, my, besides myself, though. But I digress. We should be talking about the library. Oh my gosh, there's so much text. Okay, I'll just go over this myself. Because that's just, that's just what he's going over. So, you have the Gate of Memoirs, which is just the cutscenes that pay out before every area. Unit Memoirs, which just gives you information on the unit. They're uh, base HP, base defense, base attack, and base recovery. And um, lore on the units. Uh, attacking animation, standby animation, default animation. Effects. That's what her normal attack looks like. This is what her bravery looks like. And then you can zoom in on her... I, I, I forget how you do that. Oh. 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 This is the thing I can't show off right now. Because, like... I can't... Cursor. <laughs> okay. So yeah, it gives you all that. Uh, I think memory is just like tells you. Oh yeah, this is, the, this is the, that's probably like the most useless thing there. Like it's, a, it's a huge catalog of all the items you've gathered, but like it doesn't tell you where you can gather them, what enemies drop them, or any of it, anything of that sort. It just says, oh yeah, and this is it. Actually, let me check it real quick. Um, yeah, it does not give you anything of interest, honestly. Um, this is gonna be, yeah, you can't, you, yeah, this is gonna be useful later, like, much, 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 much later on in our adventure. Spheres, again, also gonna be useful much, 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 much later on in our adventures. Uh, this is the real thing we wanted to get into right now. You're casting, correct? A summoner from the, from the regular army under orders from the Acro Summoners Hall. We've been expecting you. My name is Sarah Starride. It's actually a really nice name. I serve as a guide here at the administration office. Allow me to explain to you all there is to know about our facilities. Not only can you check your battle records here, you can also retrieve dungeon keys, which actually... They're useful starting off, but they become obsolete later on. I'll get into that later on as well, and like not this episode, but next, um, maybe not the next one, but like at some point. What is it, Dungeon Key, you ask? Well, uh, she's just gonna explain everything that I'm gonna go over right now. Okay, I'm figuring you can actually access all this again in the, um, memoirs, in the 
Imperial Library. It's a good thing I went over that first thing. So, receive key, because we, we can receive keys right now. Metal keys are used to unlock um, the Metal Gate, which I guess you control here in a bit. Uh, missions, records. We've already completed nine things in our records. And this is where, like, this is where we're gonna be the, the most, most useful thing in this thing. Um, uh, I'm gonna, I'm guys, filled, check, we get 100 merit points. This is gonna be the most useful thing. You will be coming back to this screen so many times, picking up so many merit points, and just, like, it's so useful. Always come, always check this deity. Like, you're gonna want to, you, you're going to want to check this deity. Confusion performed, check. One evolution performed, check. Favorite of the unit, check. And then general. A hundred honor points accumulated, check. The other campaign, we get a fire god. Level three, we get a water god. Uh, I'll be picking those up later. Uh, we can also trade, we can trade various things. We can trade Zell, which is just Trading this value up here for more merit points. Trading karma, this value right here for more merit points. Trading units, you can actually trade units of. I think it's the lowest rarity you, rarity you can trade is four. It's either three or four. It's one of two. And you get varying degrees of um, merit points depending on multiple factors: the rarity of the unit, the level of the unit, whether or not their um, Skills have been enhanced, whether or not they have an enhanced skill on them, all that fun stuff. And this is probably the most useful thing to trade, spheres. You're gonna get a lot of spheres you don't need. Sell all the spheres you don't need. I'm gonna get, get rid of those. The rest of these I'm, I may get rid of later on, I may hold on to them, I'm not sure. They are useful for other things later on, much, 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 much later on. Um, so yeah. And the last thing I want to cover really quick on the screen is challenges. There are challenges you, you can do every day, these change daily. So come back and check these um, every day. So 21 kills performed, I can actually do that easily. And you always, for these regular challenges, you always get 200 points. Uh, but sometimes you get uh, special challenges, which get which get you a lot of points. So definitely check here every day. Uh, check here for the special ones. I think it's once a month on the weekend or every other weekend. It's one of the two. I think it's one weekend every month. I think it's the first weekend. Uh, slots. This is gonna be useful later on. I'm. I get more explanation. This isn't useful right now. Um, actually, it could be depending on when you got in. It might, yeah, it's actually gonna be uh, n not right now, but later on during this during the collaboration of it. So check back when you get coins in. Though I do have some bit of a advice there as well. And the mini games, it's exactly that, just mini games. My God, that was a lot. I'm not done there either. Um, there's another thing that I'm gonna want to address um next episode actually because there's a thing going on right now I think. So let's check the summary journal, see if we've done anything else. Nope. Um can we do anything here? That's all we can do. Okay. Um and I think that would do it for now. This has been a really long episode. I do apologize. Um But yeah, I will be back probably tomorrow with another video, so check that out. Be excited and if you have any if you have any tips for this game, let me know down below. If you uh, let me know what you want to see from this game down below, and just like if you like the video, like it, and if you want to see more of this, subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Just just occurred to me. I didn't do this, so I'm gonna do this right now. That's the wrong one. I have a friend request from. Ooh. I'm gonna do this right now. Oh hey, an Omni. Who am I getting? Who's my new Omni? Shura. Um, actually, for those, there's one person in particular that I'm listening to, and you know who you are when I say this. 
This is actually a partner unit to, um, I guess a parallel to history. Another unit that you can get from these gates. So, yeah. There's that, and I do actually have my, on my other files, so. Something to note. So, yeah, now I'm gone. Bye.